a giant dome atop a Montreal theater. But it's not the shape that's a standout. Inside the satosphere, researchers are taking entertainment to a whole new dimension. What makes the satosphere unique is the idea of projecting the images all the way to the floor. It's by going inside the image that we create this 3D effect. The dome, developed by the Society for Arts and Technology, measures 18 meters in diameter and offers spectators a 360-degree view. It's a so-called immersive universe, thrusting the public into a mix of media, with eight video projectors and 157 speakers all around. The images and sounds bounce off the curved walls and flood the dome. Viewers aren't just watching the show, they're a part of it. I almost got motion sickness. In the beginning, cinemas had a curtain in front of the crowd and rows of seats like this. This is how we viewed cinema for the past hundred years, in this little box. Now we think we've given ourselves a new playing field for the next century. Just beneath the satosphere in the SAT's labs, researchers are working on the next phase of immersive reality. This camera has six lenses, working together to create a 360-degree view. It can film a scene anywhere, then transmit it live to the satosphere, allowing viewers to explore a place, even when it's thousands of miles away. Today, with images taken from different vantage points, we can create an environment 360 degrees around a person and literally embed them inside an image. We can even project the person onto screens that work like mirrors and thus allow someone to float right in the middle of a scene. The satosphere's cutting-edge technology is not just for cinema buffs. Architects, government agencies and even hospitals are exploring ways to use it and to build immersive worlds of the future.